What's happening, guys? My name is Crazy Cinco, and we are back again today for episode four of our Pokemon Sapphire really randomized Nuzlocke. And uh, I'm going to be doing something new on each of these uh, Sapphire videos. Is I will be doing a code card giveaway for the TCGO. If you have not already checked out my uh, TCG openings, go ahead and check those out. There are some free codes available in there. And also, for each of the LP videos, I will be doing a giveaway. To be entered in the giveaway for five code cards on each episode, all you have to do is subscribe, like the video, and leave one comment and one comment only, and that will get you entered in every episode. Uh, you have to do it on every episode, and it will get you entered for five code cards each time. So now, let's get going. We will do a quick team recap, as we did get a few encounters last episode. Here we have Jack, the water type Furret, with Ancient Power, Lovely Kiss, Sky Uppercut, and Sonic Boom. And then we have the Poison type Prim, the Delcaddy, with Uproar, Grass Whistle, Tackle, and Splash. We have the Grass Ghost Magnemite, with Barrage, Toxic, Aerial Ace, Revenge. The Psychic type Bugs, the Azumarill, with Brick Break, Hydro Pump, Rain Dance, and Jump Kick. And then we have the Grass Poison Jeffrey the Kadabra with Focus Punch, Spark, Submission, and Headbutt. And to finish it off, we have the Ground type Gemini the Haunter with Grudge, Defense Curl, Heat Wave, and Protect. So let's get going. I believe we need to go up to the, uh, the cave up there today. Is there anyone in here that wants to give me anything? I think... Uh, I think it's the other building where we will get the Silk Scarf, power up those um, normal-type moves. Let's see. I don't think there's anything in here that we can get, but just in case. All right, and uh, come on. All right, we will come over here and grab us a Silk Scarf. from this guy. All right, do we have anyone that can actually utilize that? We have Sonic Boom, that always has 20 though. Barrage, Headbutt, you know what? I think we're actually gonna give it to Hector for Barrage. So let's give him the Silk Scarf and let's get going up to all right, so here is Route 106. We can fish off of this route and uh, actually get a new encounter. Aromatherapy, you know, that's not actually that bad. I think we'll get rid of Lovely Kiss because we also have Grass Whistle on uh, Prim. We'll battle this guy. I know there's some items over there over the top of the, uh, of the cave. So we will go snag those. And let's switch in Jeffrey, get him a little bit of experience. Actually, let's see if he can do anything. Okay, he can do something. Not bad, Jeffrey. Not bad. Can you stay in? Okay, never mind. He has Volt Absorb. We are going to swap out. So let's see how much our uh, Silk Scarf Boosted Barrage does. Three, four, I only hit four to- Oh, I was not watching very carefully. And we just lost our starter, Hector, who we just gave the Silk Scarf to. Um, alright, well, I guess I deserve that for not watching. We got a Shoal Shell. And I think we got Shoal Sand or something a couple episodes back. But, since I am careless and don't watch things, uh, we have to go ahead and put Hector the Magnemite into the death box. Oh, I can't believe I let myself do that. He lived on one, and then I just kept going. 
All right, well, I guess we can come over here and get our Route 106 encounter. Let's see if we can't replace our Magnemite. Apparently, we cannot. Uh, got away. Not even a nibble, come on. There we go. We got a Sneasel. All right, that's not anything to sneeze at. Ha 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 ha. Sorry, that was really bad. Um, you know, I don't want to risk anything, so I'm actually going to heal up. Never mind. Oh, I didn't mean to throw a ball. I meant to heal up. Well, good thing he didn't attack. Memento. He just killed himself. So, I guess we don't get our Route 106 encounter because he killed himself. That's always good. Did I heal up after that? I did not. Let me go heal. And then we will head on into the cave that I can't remember the name of off the top of my head. Alright, we're heading into Granite Cave. Yep, that guy gives us Flash. And let's see if we can get us an encounter in here. We got the Twisted Spoon. We have a, like two Psychic types, but no Psychic moves. All right, our encounter for Granite Cave is a Cubone. He's got 20 HP, right? I hope so. He does, or she does, my bad. And I'm a water type, so that's gonna hurt. Oh, don't kill yourself with recoil. Okay, thank you. But I am going to switch out now because I am not looking to die. No! Don't kill yourself with recoil, please. I want to catch you. I need to re No! Ah! This thing is killing me. Come on, great ball. Great ball. I just great balled you. You best stay in that ball. There we go. All right. We got the lonely Pokemon Cubone. Cubone pines for the mother it will never see again. Oh my god, that is sad. That is sad. Seeing a likely likeness of its mother in the full moon, it cries. Oh my god. The stains on the skull the Pokemon wears are made by the tears it sheds. Oh wow, that is... That's actually, like, depressing. That's not just sad, but that's, that's like, crippling. Oh my goodness. What do I call you? I'm just gonna call you Sadness. We now have Sadness the Cubone. Okay, let's check out Sadness. We have the Grass type. Man, we got like three Grass types now. Inner Focus with Ice Punch, Follow Me, Volt Tackle, and Aurora Beam. Okay. Let's get out of this cave because we do not have Flash yet. Um, oh, we could have had a Ludicolo, but we got a Cubone. Okay, all right. I mean, I, I mean, I can complain, but there's really no sense in it. Uh, let me heal and then if, see how much money we've got because I am uh, pretty sure I'm out of Pokeballs. Is there a Mart here? Is there a Mart? Is there really not a Pokemon here? Can you buy stuff in this house? I really don't want to have to go back. Okay, looks like we're going back. Alright, so let's go grab us some Pokeballs because we can get our Route 107 encounter over to the right side of uh, Duford Town. Grab nine balls, and we will head back. Ooh, we can get our Petalburg City encounter, actually, also, with the rod. Not a nibble. Come on, give me something. Ooh, a bite. I think normally you find, like, Whalemers here. And we got a Dugong, okay. Let's see if we can't do anything with this. Go, Sonic Boom! Okay. And it used Bite. 
So let's just see if we can Pokeball this thing and call it a day, because I would love to get me a Dugong. I mean, I guess depending on- never mind. Uh, depending on what type it is, it could add something to the squad. Let's see if we can put it asleep. There we go. That should be easier to catch. Three... Ah! Why can you even get out of the Pokeball if you're asleep? Like, you're asleep. Alright. The Sea Lion Pokemon. Dugong loves to snooze on bitterly cold ice. The sight of this Pokemon sleeping on a glacier was mistakenly thought to be a mermaid by a mariner long ago. Oh, please be a female. Yes, I'm naming it Ariel. Because it is a mermaid. There we go. And did you go to the box? Or did you go... Yeah, you went to the box. Alright. We officially have our first Pokemon in the box. I guess it's not dead. No. Oh, it has a Sunstone. Yo. Let's check you out. We have the ground type Ariel the Dugong with Synchronized. Pulling the Sunstone with Amnesia, Stockpile, Scratch, and Bite. I think we're just going to leave her there for now. Uh, just because we already have a ground type in Haunter. Um, and we actually have three Pokemon we need to grind up. So I will probably do that, uh, I guess, before the next episode. I'm not sure when we need to take on Brawly. Uh, we, we might need to do that in the next episode also. So, what else is there to do in this town? I think really all there is is uh, this cave, which I guess I can do without Flash. And I, I could have had an Ivysaur! Got a Cubone! <sighs> oh, Cubone. I think I could probably get through here. I have played 3rd Gen a ton, so I could probably get through Granite Cave without... Uh, the need of Flash, there's an item, yeah. A Magnet! Do we have an Electric-type move? I'm pretty sure we do. On Sadness. The... Volt Tackle... Wait, we have another one, right? Yep, Spark. Who should I give it to? Should I give it to... Let's see, 65 base power... And 120 base power. So I guess we'll give it to Jeffrey because his move is already uh, weaker than Sadness. <laughs> I love the name Sadness. Man, there's Feebass on like every route so far too. Alright, there should be an Everstone up here, I think. Uh, it probably won't be an Everstone because it's been randomized, but... Or is that in the next room? Okay, that's what I thought. And we need to come through here because we have to, uh... We have to talk to Steven Stone. There's a Jirachi! I could have had a... Whoa, that did a lot of damage. I could have had a... Whoa! I could have had a Jirachi. But I got a Cubone. I almost actually got bodied by that Jirachi too. That thing almost took me out. A Wabafat. Okay, what is up here? Is that... No. Oh, I think I, think I know where I am. I hope I know where I am. I just said that I was really good at this. Man. Okay. Um. I might be lost? Question mark? Ooh, I got through. Okay, and through here is Steven. Alright, we'll kill this thing, and I am on one. I am living on one. I'm going to switch out to Jack, because I do not need to lose another Mon this episode. Here's Steven! Alright, he gives us TM-47, which is normally Steel Wing, but it is actually Charm. Wow. 
Okay, our HMs in this, uh, or our, our TMs in this randomized version are absolute garbage. So now that we talked to Steven, I don't think there's anything else to do other than beat Brawly uh, in this town. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna end today's episode here, and then we will grind before beating Brawly, uh, before the next episode so we can actually beat Brawly. So we can move on to Slate Port City. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure that's all there is here to do. Did we get our Route 107 encounter? Actually, I don't think we did. So we'll do that and then we'll wrap up today's episode right here as soon as we catch our Swablu. Why? Never mind. We're going to end today's episode right here after not catching the Swablu. Anyway, guys. Go ahead and leave your thumbs up down below, and don't forget to subscribe and leave a comment so you can get entered in the uh, giveaway for the code card, and don't forget to do that on every subsequent episode, every episode after this one also, because I've got probably 60 or 70 code cards that need to be given away. So I'm going to get out of here, guys. I'll see y'all later. Peace.